watching Channel 4, the local station, home of NewsForJax.com. The morning show starts now. And their stories we do every single year. The richest celebrity, Forbes top billionaires around the world. And many of us ask ourselves, what do these billionaires know that the rest of us don't know? Joining me now to discuss this is top business building expert, Paul LaJoy. Thank you for coming in today. Thank you. I want to give a little bit of your history. So you were born in Africa, Cameroon, Africa. Right. You went to school in England. Right. You lived in Taiwan. Yeah. Now you're in the United States. You lived in California. Right. Uh, you have seen so much, and that has given you the perspective to write, it's impossible to be poor in America. Yes, when if we you see implement so this many, book. If you implement the book. Yes. All right. So we see so many people that, that obviously don't take the principles that you believe you need in order to be wealthy. What are they? Well, the first one is vision. You've got to have a vision, right? Because for lack of vision, what happens? People perish, right? Mm -hmm. So if you have vision, so what do you want for your life? That's the first thing I've, you have to identify. You know, my mom always said when I was a little girl, even before I went to college, she's like, what, what's the goal? And I'm yeah. like, I don't really know. And yeah. she's like, you got to have a goal because when you don't have a goal, you have nothing to reach for. Right. And then you get bored and you just end up falling by the wayside. Yeah. So you that's that vision. That goal. Yeah. Okay. You've got to have that vision. It, and the vision is not about you. It's about your world. How do you make your wealth, your community, your society, how do you make it a better place? And that vision is, should be something you said that you are passionate about because if the passion is not driving you, you're not going to continue to do it and do it well. Ultimately, because, see, I tell people this is an analogy I use. When you want to eat rice today for your dinner, what do you do? You don't just go and eat raw rice. No. you got to cook the rice, and then after that, you're going to season it, mm -hmm. right? Basically, you got to have uh, fish, you know what I mean, vegetables and stuff like that. Then you have to have the other ingredients to make the rice look really nice right. and taste really good. So you got to have the passion. Without passion, you're not going anywhere. Okay, so the vision, the passion, what else? Well, it's, of course, you got to have the action. Okay, you may have the vision. You may have the passion, but you don't have. You don't take action. You're going nowhere. You got to take action. You know, a lot of people listening to you now, they're like, you know, I don't live in an environment that is conducive to me doing these things. What would you say to those people making excuses? I think in America you have one environment. So, for example, right now, let's say you're in Florida, where you guys are, and there are no jobs here. For example, you can go to North Dakota, right? Move. I mean, you got to move to North Dakota. That's where they have oil right now. You got to get a job. Right away, you got to take action. That's the thing, the right environment. Yeah. You got to position yourself in the right environment. You know, I think the key to what you're saying, though, is you have to be flexible and be willing to move where the opportunity is. So we appreciate you coming in, Paula Joy. So if you're interested in learning more, because you said you have 12 principles, the right. book is It's Impossible to Be Poor in America. Yes. And we appreciate you coming in today. Well, thank you. All right, <laughs> Stacey, over to you. Thanks so much. Well, Jacksonville Magazine is searching for a new cover model. After the break, we'll let you meet uh, the women that made the final cut before one of them wins the top prize. First, though, we want to alert you to breaking news alert. Two southbound lanes are closed on University in front of Love Grove Elementary. That is just north of Beach Boulevard.